eyeshadow singles. Okay, so let's go with this Dome Beauty Diamond Shadow in Marble. I think I'm going to get rid of this. It's still in the package, but I think I have one. M Princess. This is in Chestnut. I'm going to get rid of this one. It's still in the package. That's a really pretty color, keeping that one. I don't know. I'm going to get rid of it anyway because it's brand new. Never used it. Just get rid of it. So there's two things I'm going to get rid of. This Hikari one I'm going to keep. I have ColourPop ones. I just bought four of these off of Zany Laney. Um, this one was my original one, I want to say. Yes, this one is my, I only had one ColourPop. This is in the color Lala. Love that, keeping that. All my ColourPop ones I'm going to keep. And then these four I just got off of Z Zany Laney. Um, this is the 90210. And this has got a beautiful, like, sheen to it as well. I'm going to keep that. Then I have On the Rocks. Oh, you can tell this one's dried out a bit because um, it's rotating in the pan. So I need to try to use up this as much as possible. That one's so pretty. I love the glitter that's in that one. And I have this one, Get Lucky, which is a cool tone gold. This one's also rotating in the pan, so it's drying out. But it's still swatching really good, so. And then this one is Crimper. That one's really pretty as well. So yeah, keeping all of those. Even though a couple of them are rotating in the pan, that's all right. I will get use out of them before they go bad. I'll put them in a project if need be. Really don't see myself getting rid of much. Okay, so this one here is a Wet n Wild single in Brulee. Everybody has this, but I'm gonna get rid of Brulee. This Veramona shade, so pretty, keeping this one. Look at that, oh, so pretty keeping that. This Pacifica in Treasure, I really do like, but I think I'm going to get rid of it because I haven't used it in a while. This one I just got from Zany Laney. This is a Bella Pierre um, in Reluctance. It's a beautiful green. It is a pigment though, but it's a super pretty green. Oh, do you see that? Yes. Yes, I know you see that. I know you see that. Okay, so let's go in. I have this Julep Orbital Eyeshadow. I love this. I used to wear this all the time. As you can see, I put, got a nice little dent in it. But that one's so pretty, keeping that. This Pacifica Trio in Skinny Dip Crush and Lovely, I'm going to get rid of this. Um, this one is an Ulta one. And I think I'm going to get rid of this one as well. Yeah, I'm going to pass this one on. Just because I have some of those ColourPop ones that are like it. This one is in Glitz. It's a foil, a loose foil topper. It's all balled up in beads. That's kind of weird. Ew. So it's a foil, but it's so extremely messy. Uh-uh. This is going to go. Ye bye bye You are bye bye This is awful. My hand is like so extremely glittery. This Jessie's Girl purple one I'm going to declutter because I have purples in my collection. just want to get rid of that. This is a NYX one in Punk, Punk Heart. This is a beautiful metallic purple. Look at that. Keeping that. This is a BoxyCharm exclusive Dobner Cosmetics for Glossy Box. And this is Glossy Mauve. I'm going to keep this one. This is such a pretty color as well. Okay. 
I have two Urban Decay ones. This is Urban Decay in Scratch, which is a beautiful pink shade. Oh, love that. So pretty. And then I have Midnight Cowboy, which was my birthday gift last year. Actually, both of these were my birthday gift. Midnight Cowboy was my birthday gift from Ulta. And this one was my birthday gift from Urban Decay itself. They allowed me to pick out my own color. So those were both birthday gifts last year. This e.l.f. smudge pot I am trying to pan, so I'm going to keep that. This Hikari in mink cream pigment. Um, I'm actually going to get rid of this one. I'm shocked. Okay, I have two cargo ones. This is in Yukon. Love this one. Keeping that. Then I have a cargo in Province, and I love this. Like, it's got a slight duochrome esque look to that purple. I'm gonna keep that. It's so pretty. Oh, look at all this glitter that's on my hands, and that's all from this. Ew. I can't get rid of the glitter. It's just everywhere. That's awful. It's awful. Okay. So I have two Japanese products. This is their 03. This is their duo, I want to say. Can I open you? This is the green and brown one. Yes. This is the green and brown duo. This is so pretty. Look at that. Ah, uh, keeping this Japanese. Plus, I love the packaging. It just brings me back to my childhood in the 80s. And this is 01. This one's a, such a pretty color as well. Great highlight. But, I mean, look at those. I have this Marsk eyeshadow in Your Toasted. And I'm actually going to get rid of this pigment one, I think. Oh, it's really pretty, but I feel like I have colors like that, so that's going to go. Then I have this Jelly Pong Pong Cosmetics one. This one I got from uh, Zany Laney as well. And it's this beautiful duo. Those are so pretty, and this has got like a little pinky tone to it, keeping that so pretty. Then I have this City Color Shimmer Eyeshadow. I actually was quite surprised about this. I mean, look at that. Oy. Keeping that. And now I'm down to my Milani ones. And I think I'm going to keep all my Milani ones. Okay, so this one is Bella Fuchsia. It's beautiful. Pink. Oh, so pretty. So soft. This one's Bella Charcoal. Bella Silver. Pretty. Bella Navy. This one didn't swatch as good as the other ones, but still really pretty. Bella Cobalt, which is my favorite one. Oh, yeah. Okay. Mm hmm. Look at that. Beautiful. Bella Teal. This one has got a little duochrome shift to it. Look at that. Oh, so pretty. And then Bella Sky, which is this really pale blue. Mm. This one doesn't swatch as good as the rest. I have to build it up. I still like it. And then Bella Pink is the last one. So, keeping all those. So out of my single shadows, I didn't get rid of a whole lot, but that's alright. I knew I wasn't going to get rid of a whole, uh, like a, a bunch. So, Dome Beauty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Got rid of ten singles. 
That's better than none, right? Right. Ten singles. And an eleven. So I got rid of eleven and I'm keeping a bunch. Oh my goodness. Ooh, I'm keeping twenty-eight. That's not very good. Not very good at all. Oh well. But this is more of a manageable number for me, so happy to get rid of all of those. Yay. Oh, here's my second box of stuff that I'm getting rid of. This is just randoms. I have two Wet n Wild um, lip liners. I'm going to declutter both of those. I'm going to declutter this white Rimmel liner. I don't like it. I'm not going to use that. I have two of these Real Her things, uh, lipstick and lip liner. I'm going to get rid of them. I didn't even open them out of the package. This Outlast in Spiced Latte, I'm actually going to give this to Lissa because I think she'll look pretty in it. So this is going to go. Lip Scrub, I'm going to keep this. I'm using another one in, um, right now. These are all rings from um, bath bombs and stuff. Um, I've got a bunch of eye primers. I'm going to keep them all. I have three Lorac ones, one Coastal Scents, and then right now I'm using up this one, but I'm going to keep them all just because I use them all. I have buffer things. I have eyelash glue. Keep. I only have two eyelash glues. going to keep them both. This is a sample of a Makeup Forever eyeliner, which needs to go up there. This needs to go to Lissa. I think everything else. This lip and hand polish, love this. This is in vanilla bean. So good. But yeah, that's all of that. I have some unused lip products. This is a cargo in Gobi. I'm going to declutter this because I haven't even opened it. So I'm going to get rid of that. This one's a, a Duche lip gloss in the color, this has no name, but I'm going to declutter this. This is brand new, just going to get rid of it. I have two of these brow products by Zui. It's Organic Brow Definer. I'm going to get rid of them because I have my brow box here and then I have this one from Alme that I use a lot. I'm just going to declutter both of these because I'm not going to use them. I'm not going to get to them before they go bad. Um, here's another brow product. I'm just going to declutter that as well. Okay, went through all that. Here are some lashes. I'm going to keep those. And then I have mascaras. Oh, this one, Benefit Air Patrol. I'm going to get rid of this. This is brand new. Okay, now on to mascaras. I think I got rid of all my mascaras that I wanted to. I have this NYX Full Forced one I want to try. This Maybelline push-up one I want to try. Laura Geller Glam Lash I want to try. I have this Marcel Twist Up, which I want to put, try this one up against the Julep one. High end versus low end. It's mineral fusion graphite one. I'm actually gonna get rid of this one. Yay. Alme one coat mascara. Love this, keeping this. And then I have a L'Oreal Voluminous one I'm gonna keep. So I didn't get rid of much, but that's alright. I decluttered a lot of my mascaras beforehand, so I don't have a whole lot of mascaras, but, um, yeah, well, look at all the stuff I just decluttered. I have a Brow Gal by Tanya Crooks. I'm going to get rid of this one, too. I'm just not going to use it. It has three brow shades in there. Just not going to use it. So, I just got rid of all of this in that drawer. Oh, boy. I'm getting rid of a lot of stuff. I did not think I was going to get rid of this much stuff. 